tell me I'm in stop, or tell me I'm unbreakable, or something like that. It's kind of, it's, I think, like, their main, or the lead singer is a woman. So, it's not that common for a Christian rock band, I don't think. <laughs> but that reminds me, 10th hour, uh, my, which used to be my second hour in first semester, but now it's my 10th hour in first, second. How many hours do you have? I have a total of seven classes a day. But, um, the thing is, my school decided to get really confusing. Because, like, last year, they went, like, hour one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This year, they have hour one, two, three. And then there's four, five. Then six, seven. And then seven, eight. Something like that. And then nine, ten. It makes no sense. Okay. I mean, we have three lunches, though. Did they teach Common Core? Yeah. That explains it. Yeah, yeah. You know... One thing, though, I just want to, like, this is for a different video, though, mm -hmm. but I actually consider atheism a religion. It technically is, because yeah. I, I, lo I looked up some definitions and stuff for religion and then atheism stuff. I mean, not every religion has a god. Mm -hmm. Atheism doesn't have a god. Mm -hmm. Okay? Not every religion believes in the afterlife. Atheism does not believe in the afterlife. Really. I mean, when you start going well, yeah, through stuff. Buddhism, they believe in rebirth. So. I mean, yeah, that's not, I mean, it's not really like a place that you go after your death. I mean, you just, come, you just no, circle back around. I'm sorry, that's, that's what I meant to say. Yeah, uh, yeah, it's just, it's not really different. So if, like, see, I was told to write a uh, three-paragraph pa three essay mm -hmm. on, um, on, like, you know, something that may come up in Supreme Courts in our lifetime. Mm -hmm. And I did, uh, did, you know, how atheism is really religion. So mm -hmm. if Atheism is somehow considered to be religion, which I believe it is. Mm -hmm. Plus, many are Christians do too think it is. Then, then that means the government has been breaking the uh, has been breaking the Constitution for decades. You know, I just thought of something. All this craziness that's going on in the country right now is that. This reminds me a lot of, um, for those uh, Stargate fans out there, in the later seasons, um, the the team, um, SG-1, they eventually stumble across this priest um, wandering around on a planet, oh, I seen and that. he proclaims that he's trying to spread the religion of origin. And their, their common phrase or blessing is, hallowed are the ori. And they eventually they eventually come to learn of Earth. And, well, basically, long story short, a crusade starts. And, well, I mean, I'm going to spoil a few things here. So, so just if you don't know, uh, spoilers right now. So if you're looking about starting SG-1, or if you're getting close to being later in the seasons, I would highly recommend stop, stop listening right now because I'm going to start spoiling a few things. But basically... The spirit, the 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 ori, the offset of the ancients, they start giving plans to to their people, to their followers, tons and tons and tons of technology, and so that way they can start their own crusade. And basically, the premise is, worship us or die, basically, and that and that's what I kind of believe is going on right now. That that's what this reminds me of the most. Basically, this idealism war that we have going on in this country right now, right versus left. I mean, and the left remind me a lot of, of the of the Ori. Basically, bow down and believe us and let us do what we want or you're going to suffer the consequences. If you're not watching SG, if you're not watching uh, Stargate, I highly recommend watching it right now. I mean, it's an amazing show. Great show. Watch it. Do it. Well... I think that's about all the time that my phone memory has right now. I mean, we got like, I, I don't want to use it all up We got about five minutes. Yeah, so I think we should just say goodbye. This is Skippy Skip. This is the American Catfish. And we are signing off from the second ever SSP podcast. See you guys later.